What is up YouTube? This is Angel here from Strength is First. Today I'd like to talk about a new diet I've seen over the last couple months that have really piqued my interest and it is the carnivore diet. Now some of the channels such as George Bruno's channel and Elliot Hulse where I first saw the idea of the carnivore diet where you're eating strictly the animal from head to toe where you eliminate carbs completely from your diet. Now, being Asian, we have rice at least once a day, usually during dinner for me. And when I first saw this diet, it looked pretty interesting. And I decided that I do want to try it. I saw that the benefits of the carnivore diet would help me get stronger and help me be better in strength training and in the lifts during the gym. Before I tried the carnivore diet, I used to eat a bowl of oats in the morning, some a banana, I would drink a drink some yogurt, and in lunch I would usually have some rice along with some protein and vegetables. Now I have eliminated almost all the carbs during my breakfast and lunch. I would still eat my daily fruit, I'd still drink some yogurt, but instead of having my rice and oats, I would replace it with a nice piece of steak. The transition to eating just meat from my past eating habits, it wasn't too bad. I've always been somebody who has enjoyed all different types of food, changing something, changing to something that I know would benefit me and, and how I would feel was definitely a no brainer for me. Especially whenever I ate meat, I always felt very energetic. I felt very strong whenever I ate a piece of steak or I ate a piece of pork. So it wasn't an issue going over to just eating just meat. In terms of weight loss, this is something that many carnivore dieters have spoke about and I would like to share my experience with it as well. Now, when I did a partial carnivore, cause I'm still eating my rice at dinner time, over the past three weeks, I've lost about two, three pounds already. Now, when I looked at how much steak I was eating during breakfast and lunch, I could see that I wasn't eating nearly as many calories as I was before. But at the same time, I was feeling fuller. I was feeling stronger. I was feeling a lot more alert. I felt a lot brighter. So it was definitely a huge change in mindset of how changing one variable in my diet, eliminating carbs during breakfast and lunch, and being able to still feel the same same way, if not even better, and losing weight, that, that was pretty surprising for me. Now, another subject I like to touch upon is the energy levels I was feeling throughout the day. Now, during breakfast and lunchtime, that didn't really, I didn't really see much of a change, but definitely during the evening, I would feel a little crash towards the end. I would feel a little flat, I feel like I needed some sort of boost to keep going if I were to do any crazy high level, high energy level exercise. And I've seen one recommendation that a carnivore dieter suggested to just eat more fat. And clearly I haven't been taking that advice as I've just been eating the same way as, as I have the last two weeks. So I'm just eating my steak in the morning and in the afternoon and just having my rice dinner in the end. So, you know, I'm, I'm still debating, still f feeling out the diet, but overall, I'm, I was really impressed with the immediate results I already saw by just incorporating it partially already. So that's my two cents on my partial carnivore diet. And I'd like to know what you guys are trying. What's your diet like? And is it aiding you in your strength training journey? And as always guys, thanks for watching.